Hi friends! Today we're gonna read a book named Time for Kenny. So let's start. Time for Kenny. It's time for Kenny to get dressed for the day. Can you wear this shirt? No, that's daddy's shirt. Can you wear these shoes? No, that's mommy's shoe. Can you wear these shorts? No, silly. Those are his sister's shorts. Can you wear his hat? No, that's granddaddy's hat. Time to take granddaddy to the bus. Is Kenny dressed? Yes! Kenny doesn't like the vacuum cleaner. It sleeps in the closet. It roars like a raw lion. It eats Kenny's chips. It eats Kenny's cereal. Could it eat Kenny? Could it eat Kenny? No, it can't eat Kenny. But Daddy might tickle him. Kenny's sister is teaching him soccer. No hands, she says. Kenny tries to kick the ball with his foot. Josh should kick the ball with his left foot. He falls on it. He rides on it. He tries to put it. No hands. He uses his knee. He uses his head. He kicks the ball high. He kicks the ball low. He kicks it right. He kicks it left. And sometimes he makes a goal. Kenny. Kenny's bedtime is in five minutes. But Kenny is tired. It's four minutes before Kenny's go to bed. But Kenny's still not tired. Three minutes until Kenny goes to bed. But Kenny is still not tired. Two minutes before Kenny goes to bed. But Kenny's not tired. One minute until bedtime. But Kenny still isn't tired. Time for bed. I'm tired, says Kenny. But you can read me a book. The end. That was an awesome story, right? Time for Kenny. This is one of my favorites. That's why I read to it to you. Bye-bye. Let's see you in the next video.